In this edition of FX Primus Market Highlights, here are some of the notable events for the last two weeks of May that will affect the market. As recorded, coronavirus cases went beyond 5 million according to data gathered by Johns Hopkins University. Australia's unemployment rate increased from 5.2 to 6.2% only, against the market forecast of 8.3% with 575,000 jobs lost. 2.4 million Americans file for unemployment which brings to a 9-week tally now at 38.6 million, while 2 million British people filed for the same set jobless claims in April. China has abandoned setting a target for GDP growth for the first time in decades caused by the coronavirus pandemic. This week, it's going to be a shorter week for US and UK markets, but the week kicks off with German GDP and the IFO Business Climate Index. New and later US pending home sales data is out with a 21% drop in pending home contracts in March and a further 10% decline is expected for the April data. For two days in a row, Brazil's daily new deaths surpassed those in the United States. It now has the second highest number of cases globally. Looking forward for today are the Canada month-on-month -month GDP and the Euro year-on-year -year CPI. Next week, anticipate the following events that will surely have an impact on the Euro, Pound Sterling, Australian Dollar, and the U.S. non-farm payroll. Stay connected with the market with fxpromise.com.